Hi you guys out there, I'd like to show you how to make a long stem pipe. You just need a few things, a couple of drill bits, drill, got a little thimble, nice piece of dry wood here, think it's a bit of cherry, I've had it for a year or two drying, some wire, it's only ordinary garden wire, cut it into lengths, make them a couple of inches shorter each one, a nail, now you take your nail and you push it into the pit in the middle, make a hole, take your drill bit, your bit of wire in it, now I've flattened the end on that, I've banged it flat with the hammer, it's only about an eighth of an inch, as you can, don't know if you can see that place it into the little hole and start to drill. Let the drill do the work. Gently does it. Just gently. Don't push. You'll bend the wire. You just have to keep going. In and out, back and through. Put your hand down, hold it. Bang some of the dust out, back in again. Change the drill bit. Another piece of wire. Just make sure it's pretty straight. Not bad. Back in. Gentle. Just start it off right at the beginning. Slowly does it. Nice and slow. In she goes. Keep on going. It's going nicely there. Give it a bang, get as much as you can out, change the piece of wire again, all a bit boring watching somebody uh, drill but um, you know I'm just showing you how it's done. You see they're not perfect, see? But let's Oop. let me get you down there again. In goes. See him in quite a way now. Off we go again. Nice and gently. Kind of like therapy doing this. Nice and gentle. Be careful you don't let the uh, wire out of the wood while you're still drilling as it can bend easily and it hurts when it hits you. <laughs> Just 
just knock that out of there. Just give it one more blast. Change the uh, wire again. Put a larger one. make sure before you uh, rev it up as I should say it's in the wood and off we go again nice and gentle There it goes. Now I might make it look easy, but I have had 40 years of practice doing this. See how we slow it down to let it out. Third our length down there now. Change over again. Let's put a nice long piece on. Now this is very dangerous when it's this long because if this whaps round and hits you, it really hurts. So I'm going to feed it back in. Shove it along. Gently does it. You don't want to bend it. Back and two, back and two. Let's keep going. And out she pops the other end. Can you see that? Now I'm giving a good push it out. Bit of drill bit on the end there just to take it out a bit. See? Let's have a look at this end. Just make it a bit wider. What I'm going to do now is 
see this long one. See the end on it there, it's a little bit splayed. I'm gonna get me a hammer and just make it slightly bigger. In. Maybe just slightly bigger just to clean it out that little bit more. keep a long layer for cleaning it you know once you've made it and you want to give it a give it a clean you need the long piece of wire so now the next stage is drill a hole in here use the drill bit I have the drill bit the same size as the thimble you might be wondering what the thimble is for well I'll explain as it goes along plus you need a drill bit that's the same width, more or less, of your piece of wood there. See? So, here we go. Now I'll get back to you on this because it's real boring watching someone drill holes. So, when I've drilled them, I'll get back to you, show you how I'm going. Well, you guys, I've drilled a hole in the... Uh, top there, the hole in the side. Now I'm going to rub it down. I like to smooth it round. You could use it as it is, like, you know, you know, big old pipe there, like, mm -hmm. but as I said to you, I like to rub it down. Get the old sandpaper going. This is hard work, by the way, if you're doing it by hand. But of course, it's like therapy. You just have to keep going. You should know. This takes time. So what I'll do is, I'll keep going all the way around. Until I've got it into a nice shape. So it'll feel nice in the hand. So, I'll get back to you, because... Like I say, it's boring watching someone sanding down. You'll see the, uh, the effects. It soon, you soon get there. It's just rubbing off. Just keep at it until you've got it into a night nice shape. I'll be back to you in a moment. Show you how I've got on. Well, you guys, just finishing off now, giving it its final little rub down. Looking real good, that now. Let's give that another little go. Proper therapeutic, especially when oops, you get a nice. 
face shine like that. I think that'll do me now. I've been about an hour rubbing it down, maybe a little bit longer. That is the hard work, as I say. But now I'm going to give it a little bit of wax. Being careful that I don't get any inside the pot. Just put it on lightly. Rub it in. Try not to get any in the hole, uh, just be careful, go around. Yeah, looking good that. Let me just... I'm going to get into, into that, them grooves there. This is just to get in the, the bark bit, what I've left on there. I like leaving the bark on. Gives it a little bit of uh, character, you know. Rub it well in. Let's put my glasses on for a second while I have a look at it. Just getting it in the back there. Just rubbing it in. Let that dry for a second. Now this, you don't want any wax or anything round the end of it, so like make it look a bit somewhat like actually cleans it as well with polish so when you rub it off get me rag don't know whether you can see that now but it's quite shiny as you can see now to give this a little see the shine coming on that now but it's looking real good just give it a little another little rub one more little uh, dust over with the rag quite slippy that now. I don't know if you can see that but it's all nice and shiny. Looking pretty good to me. Now to shove the mouthpiece in. Remember no wax on this piece. In it goes. Nice and tight. And now for the thimble. Now the thimble, I've knocked the hole in the bottom of it with the nail. I sanded it off here because little jagged bits come out, you don't want to cut yourself when you're cleaning it. Now, 
into the pot give it a good hard pressing in see that nice and neat let's throw some makings in see how it smokes Well, here goes nothing. Oof, that was one big drag. Well guys, there it is. Hope you enjoyed my video. Hope that you'll uh have a little go yourself at making one. Until the next time I see you, hope you all keep safe. Until then, bye for now.